Hello, welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem. I'm Luigi Fan 64D, and we made it to Nurgle. Now we just gotta fight him. But this Hector side story, side quest came up, and I don't know what to, what's gonna happen here. Hector gains the upper hand in the Battle of Valor. Taking the lead, Hector moves straight toward the Dragon's Gate. Before his eyes, eerie ruins appear. What could they be? Are they connected to Nurgil? If they overlook any enemy lurking within, they could be attacked from the rear. Without pause, they open the rusty steel door and step inside. Chapter 32, Gaiden. The Value of Life. It's that thing again. He keeps appearing every now and then, but... What do you want, monster? You can't fight. You can't harvest quintessence. Powerless and frail, you're not but a false puppet, a pale imitation. Is this all I was capable of creating in the past? This fool? Absolutely worthless. You are my blunder, my failed morph. You are of no use to me. Go somewhere and rot away into dust. But that was the morph he gave a heart to. Uh, more of them! There's still some morphs left? So this must be the Nurgle's doing too. Hey, Lord Hector! That's that weird power again! Like in the ruins below the desert, that area where magic was nullified. A magic seal? Here? Hector, what are you talking about? What's a magic seal? I don't know. I don't know much about it. What's going on? It feels different than last time. In the desert, its energy felt so hostile. Now it feels more like... Sorrow? Hector, they're moving. I don't know who they are, but it looks like they're after a fight. Show them no mercy. Let's go! Seems this time we have to kill Kishuna. The morph. Again, he can't fight back, though. So I kind of feel bad. And because this is, you know... Oh, there's a treasure chest. That's odd. Just one chest? I can't take too many people with me, either. Oh, there's two chests. This archer's on one. Stairs. Huh. Stairs. Okay, just two treasure chests. And it looks like I'm gonna need Matthew for this one. Maybe Jafar. No, Matthew. I'm not gonna bring Jafar because Nino can't come along either. Because of this magic seal. Nino would be at a great disadvantage if I brought her along. Alright. So because there's a magic seal, all magic users are out of the question. I'm gonna leave, Nil leave Nils behind. And Ellawood and Lindis, they're they're gonna be fine. They don't need any of the extra EXP. I'll bring Barter and Carla. And Matthew. Yes. Now then, I'm going to need to trade some stuff around. Florina has Fimble Fetter, which is going to go to Nino in exchange for Thunder. Since it's much better. Actually, I don't know. Elfire, Thimble Fetter. Uh, uh, I'll have Thimble Fetter instead of Elfire. That's fine. And that 
means I'll get rid of... Oh, wait. Poor Florina. She needs to get rid of Elfire. Now she needs to take more we better weapons. Uh, there will be some people that will no longer be able to be fighting. So I'll take Lowen's nothing. Killer Lance. Yeah. And is there a Silver Lance I can borrow? Oswin. I'll just borrow it from Oswin. He won't mind. Okay. Uh, who else? Oh, Renault. He's here. That's right. Uh... Uh, he's useless right now. Lowen doesn't need anything. Raven. Carla is doing rather fine right now. Matthew. We need Matthew so he can open some doors for me. And get the and loot the chests. However, there's no Merlinus here. That's the tricky part. Because there's no Merlinus, I gotta leave some stuff behind. Alright, so I've got Barter, Florina, Carla. I gotta bring Hector. And Matthew. That's a team. For quite an odd team, but a team nonetheless. So. Are they already? Hector does not need that steel sword if he has an iron blade. Could use a better silver axe, though. I have enough to just switch them out for something like pointless as item usage. Uh, a talisman. I forgot I got that. I got that a while ago, just last chapter. That increases resistance a bit. Who could use that? Resistance is going to come in handy because we'll be fighting Nergil, if you remember. Uh, from the looks of it, Hector Nino has max re resistance. Okay. From the looks of it, it looks like Hector could use it the most. Yeah. Hector could use that talisman, because he's got 10 resistance. So he's always kind of lacking in the resistance department, so... Actually, he has the health to back it up, so I'll give that to Lindis. Let's have Lindis use that talisman. Lindis does not have the health to back it up. Now, come to think of it, What's Hector's sword level? D. It's almost a C. If it was the C, I would give him a killing edge instead of that iron blade. Because, you know, he doesn't really need that much stuff. Uh, I'll give him a killer axe anyway. Actually, do I, I have a lot of door keys. Chest key. So that's Lindy. Go to Nils, and take that last ring. Okay, now he has all the dances. I mean, songs. Dances. So he can increase whatever stat you'll, you'll need to increase. Okay. Matthew does not need anything else. He can only take those two items with him, because he'll be taking the lockpicks, using it on, a che on those two chests. So we can unlock it to get one item, and then unlock it, drop the lockpick, and it'll be fine. Carla, I don't think she needs the light brand. Actually, she doesn't have anything else to have instead. Florian, mm, actually, she could use a lance reaver, but I don't think I have. There's anyone else who doesn't need it right now. Actually, there might. No, there isn't, actually. No one else is not using a light brand, so... I mean, whatever. That's fine. I think we'll get another weapon that'll, be, that'll suffice as for one. 
and barter. What if I gave barter a longbow? Oh, he can wield a killer bow. That's right. Basically, Barter's gonna get a lot of critical hits whenever he wants. Florina should be fine. What are her stats? Um, e in swords and S rank in lances. Right. Florina will be fine with what she has. Yeah. And she's nearly max level. Yikes. Did not expect that. Okay, so we should be ready. Uh, Nils will not give me a staff support. So, what's my tactician rank? Seven stars. I think the stars increase some stats, but I don't really know. So I'm just going to quickly take a look at this. The, the, at the map. From the looks of it, we'll be fighting a lot of morphs, obviously. Uh, we have... Oddly enough, the generals don't have lances, they just have axes. Except for this one, the spear, spear. Why does that one just have a tomahawk? Just for the sake of having a tomahawk, I guess. Brave sword, light brand, tomahawk and a door key, and a spear. So basically, I don't need to bring... I don't really need to bring Matthew, then. Uh, archer... Spear. Alright, so these guys aren't too difficult. They don't look too difficult whatsoever. What I need to watch out for is... Oh, this guy has a woe down. That can be kind of tricky. But he's a morph, so he has no luck. With that said, it's a woe down. And Kishuna. Kishuna will be tough to, tough to take down. And, in addition to that, uh, every time we try to get near him, every single time we got near Kashuna, he would summon all of those high-level bodyguards around him. Oh well, we've got enough stats. We have enough battles under our belt to, uh, to take care of them. Uh, Carla doesn't, but that's fine. Alright then, let's... Let's go, then. Uh, everything seems to be in order. I'll save... No, I won't. Let's just go. We can't take Baroness! Never mind, then. I thought we couldn't. Alright, then. I don't want to go too far ahead. What's in your range? Ah, yes, let's get in range. He has a tomahawk, but... Killer bow. Killer bow. So good. And equally, Hector has a tomahawk. I'd rather not waste it, though. But still. Oh, right, and those... Those things. Archers. Uh, but thankfully, they can't reach. And because you have a... An axe. Best to dodge with a... Actually, you just stand right here. Alright. No. Ah, oh, there's more. Let's have Matthew. Now the Lance Reaver. Let's see if we can get a lethality. There we go. Nice one, Matthew. Even resistance. Too bad I'm not going to use her for the last battle, but still. That's absurd. And just out of range. 
Oh, you have a spear. You have a spear? It doesn't matter where I hit you, you're still attacking. Oh well. Nice job. Let's just move this, park this right there. Alright, Hector. Take him out. Eh. Wolf Bale. Why not? Nope. Level up for Hector. Just speed. gonna hit Hector. Oh, another one appeared. And you have a spear? Yes, you do. I'm pretty sure Florida can do something about that. It's not a KO, but it's pretty close enough. Let's just move you right up here. Nope, too dangerous. Alright, let's just uh, move you up here. Wait, you all have spears. Let's not waste the tomahawk and try to just give it a view. Nice. through the wall? Does that work? And they switch to the longbow. But there's the treasure chest. That's not good. They're starting to deal some damage. And they're starting to get more. Uh, I'm not gonna risk it on another lethality. Uh, I can move six, right? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Just gonna wait. Just gonna wait here. See if I can deal some damage. Nope. Level up for Carla. Speed and luck? Alright. Well then. Put this right here. Wait. Get rid of you. 
There we go. Hector levels up. Let's get some resistance. There we go. Put Melanus right here. And Barda can stand right here with a killer axe. I mean, bow. I totally should have bought, brought Nino along. Alright. Eh. Silver Lance. Final level up for Florina. But no defense. Oh well. Okay, there's starting to be a bit too many. Oh, a tomahawk. No. Oh, they actually hit. That actually hit. I probably should have brought Nino. It's not like there's, there's no spaces for her to attack. And besides, at least she could heal now. Let's just leave you behind. I can probably get rid of you. Nope. The one time I don't get a critical hit. Alright then. There's too many snipers. I'll just bring out the Wodow. Always works. Okay, you have a silver bow and a long bow. Mm. I'll just give it a view. Not what I planned on. Well, you're still going for Hector. So at least that's good. Nope. And he's going after us. And you go for Hector. With the longbow. The longbow is a power of, like, it has the similar power to, I think, a short bow. Which is only a little weaker than an iron bow. Hector, what are you doing? You need to live, Hector. What are you doing, Hector? Get rid of you. Level up for Carla again. Strength is good. For Swordmaster, that's good. Let's see what we can do about you. There we go.
Let's see if we can get rid of you this time. There we go. Nice one, Matthew. And let's just get rid of you. And for the finisher. And that's all I got. Going for Matthew? Nice try, but like, no. Nope. Uh, another one up here. Actually, with this light brand, I could do some damage to the general. But... He's just right there. Yeah, let's take this guy out. I'm tired of having him follow us. Level up? Now is when Hector gets all the good level ups. This guy has a rune sword. Rune swords. They're dark magic swords. They have the power... They're basically Nosferatu in a sword, which means it drains the, your opponent's health in, like, when you hit. Yeah. They can be a little tricky. Well, let's take you out. Nope. And I got both crits. Good. in here. Fortify. Fortify staff, we've already got one, but it restores all HP to the allies nearby. However, if you're, if the user is an S rank in staffs, it'll heal everyone on your team. Pretty much. Pretty sure that's what it does. A sword Slayer, and... Florida just has to stand there. And because it's a magic tome in a sword, it'll have better range. So you gotta watch out for that. I think that used the charge. Let's see. Nope. Alright, let's take care of you one shot. 124 damage. 120 damage. And I got a rune sword. And let's just take that out. Nice. And now I have a rune sword. Pretty sure this is the only way you can get a rune sword, actually. I oh, don't know. Depends on what's in that next chest. Let me guess. Spears. Of course. This time I'll actually equip the tomahawk. And you've got spear, spear, spear. Okay. Are you in range, hero? No. Yeah, 
Selena will be fine. Nope. Especially if she can't really damage them. And it goes for Merlinus. Nope. I really should stop going for the Pegasus Knight. That's max level. He should have at least backed up. I mean, you know. It makes sense. Let's try out that Rune Sword. Yeah, that would deal pretty good damage. Nope. I'm better off with the Woe Dow, though. I'll just have them switch. Tomahawk to this one? Nope. Hector looks so awkward holding that tomahawk. And go back to this one. Ah, eh, Brave Lance. Haven't used it whatsoever. Oh, it only has one left. Nope. Had his shot, but he missed. Watch, he's gonna attack Merlinus. Yep. I don't know why they keep going for him. It just doesn't make sense. Brand. Nope. Let's just switch back to the Wolf Bale. More defense. Brave sword and a light brand. Brave sword, 22 attack. Oh, what's your accuracy? 105. Could be dangerous if it wasn't Florina. But since it's Florina we're talking about here, I'm standing next to Hector. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh. It's a shame you don't get that brave sword. But I sting twice anyway. Yeah. Oh, who's that? Bolting. You've got to be kidding me. Sorry. Another rune sword! Whatever. Bolting. Someone go take care of that. I mean, yes, I know it's out of range. It's currently unable to be hit. No, to be used. However... It can easily run it back into the range. You can easily just walk here and start spamming bolting on us. And that's not good. Alright, this one has a light brand, right? And not in range of bolting. So let's just use this killing edge. Nope. No one seems to be able to hit Carla.
and Killabo to finish him off. Because Killabo always finishes him off. Ah, I see you have a tomahawk. Watch me as I equip my iron blade to combat you. Oh! You're going for Carla. That's not what I would have done, but okay. Ah, he's in range. No ho, that hurt. 30 accuracy! Alright, Florina, you better get over there quick. Come on. Just because. Yeah. The critical hit makes a different sound effect when it doesn't finish them off. I just noticed that. But nothing for defenses, though. I guess that's Barter's job. Door key. Okay. Good thing we have Melanus. Give back. Oh, don't need that. Merchant, put that away and take the door key, whichever one will do. And equip a wolf mail. Because why not? Miss. Bolting without the animation. Miss. A third! Come on! Now, what I have a feeling that the second I open this door, I'm gonna be in trouble. Let's just put my on that pillar. Yeah, the second I open that door, I'm so gonna be in trouble. Quipper. Oh, not a rune sword. You have no chance of a critical hit with a rune sword. That's a, and that's saying something for someone like Carla. Yikes. Hmm. I could try attacking him, but I'd rather not. I'm gonna wait until those are taken those uh Valkyries are taken down. As they go from Maryland S. A fourth. Now that's just overkill. Alright. Which one first? Oh, I can just one-shot them. Let's do that, then. No, I can't. I checked the wrong stat, then. Attacking the one that's near them. Really, another one. Yeah, let's switch to a. Killer Lance, I guess. I can at least try to use the to save shots. Should just leave Merlin is here. I mean, they seem to only be attacking him. Another one. 
Okay, who is the least amount of shots? Let's just take care of you. Still gonna go for Merlinus. And that one should be the last bolting. They should start going for Florina. Good, they stopped spawning. Yeah, you don't have that anymore, so let's just get rid of you. Alright. And the turn again. Nope. Been here, been there the whole time, and now you start trying to attack. All right. Let's get rid of this last one. I have many more. There are plenty of killer lances. I don't need to worry about it. Okay. Open the door. There they are. I knew it. You know... I'm not worried about this Wo Tao. Nope. <laughs> That's why I have a tomahawk. I find it weird that Hector can double shot these. And now I have Hector retreat. Oh, wait. Just try to get rid of you. Let me guess. Spears. Tomahawk. Ah, Brave Lance. should be a little more accurate. Level up for Hector for beating a fully leveled swordsman. Sword master, I mean. And now he can wield killing edge. He can wield a killing edge. Nope. Hector, the the dude who started wielding axes and just recently learned how to use a sword can now wield a killing edge. This is a bit odd. A longbow? Really? That's weird. Oh, okay, this is a bit much. This is a bit odd. And yes, I did put him there strategically. I gotta get in there somehow, but oh, I can make. I can maybe I can 
get a lethality on this guy. It's a bit ris risky, but... Oh, you know what? I need to get... Get through somehow, so I'll just take you down. Wolf Bale! Alright, now that I made it in, inside the actual arena. Let's just bring you down. Oh, wait. Either one would really work. It doesn't matter. I've got enough silver axes left. And then we take you down. Come on, I just need one critical hit. Really? 66 ra critical hit ratio. Twice, and I didn't get one. Well... I couldn't hit with a rune sword, but I'd probably miss. And that's not optimal. So I'll just try for lethality. There it is! Lethality has a chance of hitting. Uh, if you get a critical hit, half of that chance of being a critical hit could be a lethal lethality. So basically, 42% chance of it being a critical hit, a 21% chance that the critical hit will be a lethality, and that missed. Why bother? And there's one more. And I could start hitting Kashuna right now. In fact, I see no reason why I shouldn't, except they have a support right now. So I'm just gonna go bring out a silver sword and just take you out. Now you get the critical hit! Luna needs to hurry up over here. Let's do the support. Gah! Come here, you! Ah, dear barter. So you still live. What joy. You thought me dead, demon? I admit I did at first. But I did reconsider. You're too stubborn to die. Lived through far worse. We'll finish this next time. Remember that. You still wish to fight? You poor fool. And you? Where is your will to fight? What? You're holding back. And that is the greatest shame on the battlefield. I want to fight you untamed. Show me what you've got. I would be happy to. But, dear Barter, you will die. I'm ready to die. Oh, I'll, I'll dehone my skill. The warrior's path is not an easy one. Hmm... I like you. You're... interesting. Very well. Then I shall bring all my sword arts to bear. Well... Rivals. So now then, please don't you have a tomahawk again. Yes, you do. Which means I can probably use a rune sword this time. Since you can't move anyway. And this is the really awesome way to use a rune sword. Now, let's try taking you down. Kashuna. Oh, I don't have a way to do that accurately, though. Yo, Merlinus. Give me one of your best things. You don't have it. Ugh. I need a really accurate sword. Rune sword. And Matthew levels up! It's a shame that he's leveling up so much. I was going to say, it's a shame he's leveling up so much, but I can't use him. Why do you keep trying to hit Barter? Okay, do these guys spawn endlessly? 
don't know, but it definitely is giving me good EXP. Considering Carla just joined us at level what? Five? There's another level up. There's the strength. Oh, dude! A full level up. Because the last one that didn't level up was Constitution. And that doesn't level up. That doesn't go up when you level up. So that was a perfect... That, that was perfect. Okay, I'm gonna need... Uh, hmm. Ah, yes, that's one. Alright, sir. I just gotta get a hit on this... With this guy. Let's just take you down. I just need to get a hit. Alright, Florina, where are you? And he heals because he's standing on a throne. Nope. I think I'm gonna give this killing edge back to Matthew. Take a take the brave sword. Oh! Thanks. I'm gonna need this. Nope. And I didn't get it this time. Oh well, the worst he can do is aim for Hector. That's nothing too bad. I'm gonna have to borrow that brave sword, brave axe. Because while this is pretty good, I would like to try to hit twice. Missed. Uh, that's kind of irritating. Brave sword. Then again, they really can't hit me. Nah. Alright. Killing Edge would be pretty accurate, but a Wodao. I don't get to use the Wodao that much after this point, so. Oh. There we go. And she had a disadvantage. kind of frightened. But he's healing. Nope. Wait, was that one a... Oh, that was a tomahawk hitting Hector. Okay, they stopped spawning. Sorry, Matthew. I'm just gonna steal your EXP a bit. Nope. She still didn't get hit. Actually, she got hit once before, but bolting. I forgot. But this time... But... That was in a different thing. Alright, let's take you down. Or at least try. Because this one should be the last of the morphs. Nope. Alright then. Ah, oh, I can't hit him. back to full health. Nope. Uh, do I have anything in here that I can hit from a distance? A short spear.
Really? Actually, she might be the one to really do something. She's definitely the most accurate out of everyone else on my team. That's for sure. But she still missed. Ah! Yeah, no one can hit him. I think that's the point, though. And he heals so much. What's the most accurate thing I got? Silver sword? With the woe down. There we go! Well, I got him. Huh. The barrier is gone. We beat it. But what was it? We saw it one here once before. And then onto the desert. Was that the same creature? After the final blow, its body crumbled into dust. Yeah. That's the same thing that happened to those morphs. So this thing, this magic seal was a morph too, but it didn't look anything like the rest of them. But it was still a morph. When it died, I heard its voice call out. It called out a name, Nerja. Did you hear its voice? Sorrow. It was filled with a terrible sorrow. Everybody, are you ready? Once we go through here, it's on to the Dragon's Gate, final battle. Here we go! Time to crush Nergel's ambitions! Well, that was strange, but we're finally here! This is... That was so weird. But that got us a lot of EXP. I wish I brought Nino and Jafar. That would have been a lot better. Well... This is Let's Play Fire Emblem? Fire Emblem. I'm Luigi Van64D. See you next time for the final battle.